Good morning, Liu. Good morning. Did you get enough rest? Yeah. Hey, Xinhua. What is it, Liu? It's time to make our way to the village. Got it. Let's get moving. A banana. Yes, I'll take it. Looks good. Yes, I'll take it. Your house is pretty far from the village, huh, Shenhua? Oh, yes, I suppose you're right. Is there a reason for that? The quarry could be one. Sorry? The quarry. It's a special one that even I'm not allowed to enter. Ah. So, your house is there to protect it? Yes, I believe so. Father didn't tell me anything about it, though. I see. Do you know what the dragon and phoenix in the quarry were for? No, I don't. But your father carved them, right? Yes, he must have. He wasn't alone, though. What do you mean by that? They must have taken generations to complete. So, you think your grandfather worked on them, too? Yes, possibly even further back than that. Have you heard any stories about them? Not a single one. My father always said he'd tell me when I got older. Then how do you know it has so much history? Well, everyone in the village has history. The villagers? Yes, generations of stonemasons, hunters, and farmers have all lived here. The same goes for the cattle wranglers. They've been here for ages. Oh, yeah? That's just how things work here. Is this a dojo? That's right. This is Marshall Hall. It's been here for ages. Marshall Hall? Long ago, many great martial artists traveled here from all over the world. But no one comes here nowadays. Is that so? Rio, you should come here to practice when you have time. Is that... Okay. Of course. Our doors are open to everyone that comes here looking to master the martial arts. Are you a new trainee? Sorry? Hmm, you're Japanese. I am. 
The people of Bailu Village have trained here for centuries. It has history. Did you say centuries? You would do well to train here if you have lost sight of the path. You can polish your techniques. So you'll let me train here? Not only that, I'll let you prove yourself by fighting the monks here. You're on. A fight? Very well. Your first opponent shall be Red Tiger. He is our least skilled monk, but do not underestimate him. Is that all you're made of? Stop, that tickles! What say you? Will you join us? Yes, absolutely. Very well. What is your name? Ryo Hazuki. I shall have a name tag prepared for you. You will start from the lowest rank. Rank? Yes. You must fight and defeat someone above your rank in order to move up. You must train day in and day out to improve your kung fu. Whose shop is that? Over the bridge. Oh, it belongs to Uncle Tao. Uncle Tao, huh? Yes, people can get anything they need from his shop. I see. Leo, did you pack anything to eat? Why do you ask? Well, you can't run on an empty stomach. That's a very good point. Be sure to keep a little something on hand in case you get hungry later. A lot of places in the village sell food, too. Thanks. I'll keep that in mind. Leo, the herb. This is... It's licorice. You can make Chinese medicine with it. So, you can turn this into medicine, huh? Not just this. There are lots of herbs growing in Bailu. Where do they grow? They're all over the place, but you have to really look for them. Oh, really? There should be special maps at Uncle Tao's shop. Someone actually made maps? Yes, if you find enough to make some medicine. Uncle Tao will buy them from you. Okay, I'll have to keep that in mind.
Get rich quick? Are herbs really worth that much? Guess I'll take it. This is... Guess I'll take it. I'm going to lose sight of Shenhua. I'd better hurry. I would like to know. What's the tall tower just past the village square? Uh, yes. That's the bell tower. What is it for? We ring the bell if there's a fire in the mountains. Or if something dangerous is encroaching on the village. Is that why it's so tall? Precisely. It's also a useful landmark, because you can see it from anywhere in the village. That's handy. So you can find your way back to the square? If you head for the bell tower? That's right. I'll have to keep that in mind. Excuse me. Oh, hey, kid. What do you want? Have you come to apprentice under me? Oh, nothing. You're a beginner, right? You have a name? Ryo Hazuki. Well, Ryo, it's your lucky day. Fear not, for I am the great Suza Xiong. I can forge a formidable master out of the most hopeless of pupils. You stand before a Chun Tai cheer master. Um, yeah, I'm good. Thanks. What? You don't think I've got what it takes? Th that's not what I... Then let me show you what I've got. Fight me, right now. Oh, man. Look, I'm not opposed, but... It's too late now, R It was Rio, right? Thanks for that. Well, how's it feel? Pretty nice to train with a master like me, isn't it? Hmm? Uh, sure. Come by any time. I'm always up for a fight. Hi, Zushong. Good timing, bud. I was just starting to get bored. Let's spar. 
Now's not a good time. Wow, way to kill my buzz. Oh well, next time. Sorry. Excuse me. You're not from around here, are you? Yue Feng, this is a friend of mine. Um... Is that right? Have you seen the thugs that came to the village recently? Word has it they showed up at the Wong household. But Wen's lips are sealed. Maybe she'd open up to you. It's worth a shot. Thank you very much. Just be careful, okay? She'd be heartbroken if anything were to happen to you. Huh? Who would be heartbroken? Shenhua, that's who! Actually, I... Oh dear. There I go running my mouth again. <laughs> okay then. Hello? Uh, it seems nobody's home. Hello? Uh, it seems nobody's home. I better eat something before I fall over. Excuse me. Whoa. Oh. Well, what have we here? Looks like it's a young man this time. Um. There's always something interesting coming in from the Lijiang River. Huh? Uh, first a tree, then a goat. I wonder what's going to show up next. Hey. Huh? Mr. Jiang, there's something we'd like to ask you. <laughs> if it isn't Shenhua. Have you seen Wang Wen? Who's that now? You know, Mrs. Wong. Wong Wen? Oh, her. I saw her just a while ago. If you want to speak with her, then go see her. Thank you, Mr. Jiang. Maybe I'll talk to a few folks around here. Hey, I have nothing to say to a stranger. I need help with something. I have nothing to say to a stranger. Can I talk to you about something? Sh Shenhua, w what's up? This is Liu. He's a friend of mine. For real? I need help with something. Hmm? 
I'm looking for Wang Wen. I have nothing to say to a stranger. Ming Young. W w what Shenhua? Did you see Wang Wen or not? I saw her heading toward the Verdant Bridge. Thanks, Ming Young. Oh, uh, don't mention it. I'm just, you know. Excuse me. Huh? What is it? Hello, one. Senhua! This is my friend, Yong. Oh, really? Your friend? I'm looking for some thugs. Have you seen any? One. Did the thugs show up here? That they did. But my husband drove them off. He's really good to have around in times like these. What did they want? That's what I'd like to know. They kept hollering something about wanting to meet the stonemason. I was inside and didn't see anything. My husband told me about it after it was over. I see. Let's talk to Shiren, one's husband. Good idea. Thanks again. Thanks, one. Hi there. What is it, Ryo? I'd like to talk to your husband. Is he still working? He's on watch duty at the Verdant Bridge this time of day. I see. Thanks, one. Excuse me. What is it? There's something I want. What's that? Oh, changed your mind? No. I'll give it a try. I'll give it a try. Hello, Leo. Da Tong. What's with the two of you? Is Wong Shiren around? I'd like to talk to Shiren. He left to patrol Longwei Shan. 
It's up ahead. You'll see signs for it. I see. Excuse me. What do you want? What are you two doing here? Uh, there's something I want to ask. I'm looking for some thugs. Have you seen any? Did you see two of them the other night? Yeah, a big man with long hair, and a man with a shaved head and a spider tattoo. Tell me more. They barged in during the middle of the night when I was sleeping. They kept yelling this and that about a stonemason. I told them they had the wrong house and drove them off. Then I went right back to bed. Is there anybody else? Do you know where they went after that? That I don't know. But I do know that there were other witnesses. A man I met at the bar was talking about it. He was a bookie with a scar on his face. What kind of scar? A big one. On his cheek. We should talk to him, Leon. Yes, let's go find him. Hey, Shenhua. Yeah? I think we should split up and look for the bookie. I'll search from here to the village square. You go from the village square to the next settlement. Got it. I'll see you later. Yeah. Hey, bud. Bud, over here. You can't play unless you buy some tokens. Okay. Buy some tokens if you want to play. Hi there. Buy some tokens if you want to play. It's 10 you're on for 100 tokens. How many do you want? Thank you. You can exchange tokens for prizes, so be sure to head to the prize exchange after. You can then take your prizes to the pawn shop and sell them, so more tokens means more money. Good luck out there. Excuse me. Hello there. Welcome. Care for some lucky hit? This is Circle One. There's something I want to ask. Do you know a bookie with a scar on his face? Sorry, I don't know who that would be. Hey, 
How about some lucky hit? I know you want to. Excuse me. Huh? You talking to me? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, wanna have a drink with me? It's going on your tab, laddy. Seems like you've already had a few. I'm just having a good time. I'm not drunk. Who said that? Excuse me. Hey there, come to play? I recommend Bailu Village's own turtle racing. Do you know a bookie with a scar on his face? Say what? Oh, you mean Shuan? Where can I find him? He's in the village square doing business. Shuan's a good guy. I owe him because he gave me permission to do business here. I see. Turtle races, huh? Hey, here to play? I recommend Bailu Village's own turtle racing. How much will you put down? Which turtle will it be? This is the only way to get rich quick in Bailu. Nice, bro. Go again. I'll come back. Excuse me. Step right up for a thrilling game of one shot. There's something I want to ask. Do you know a bookie with a scar on his face? Can't say I know much about this village. I see. It's here, too. Come one, come all! All right, pick your platform! What are you betting? That's 
some skill you've got there. How about another round? Not now. Stop by again sometime. Excuse me. Hello there. Would you like to play some dice? The rules are simple. Roll a bigger number than me, and you win. I need your help with something. Do you know a bookie with a scar on his face? There's no one like that in Joy Park. Why don't you try another venture area? I see. Excuse me. Hey there, lad. How about a game? A scarred face. This must be the guy. Huh? You say something? There's something I want to ask. So what? You're not here to play? I'm looking for someone who's seen those thugs. Oh, yeah. That guy. Where can I find him? I'll tell you after we play. Okay. Uh, lately, I'm not as good as I used to be. Why don't we let our throws do the talking? A challenge, huh? Yeah. Beat me and I'll tell you. How about it? Let's do this. Kung Fu's a little lacking. Go train at Marshall Hall and we'll start over. <laughs> right, Marshall Hall. I won't be worth anything if I don't eat.
Looks like I can practice horse dance here. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. Horse dance, huh? Maybe I'll give it a shot. Maybe I'll practice some more. Maybe later. This is a name tag from one of the students here. Shrin Shan Sun. What's a bookie's name doing on one of these cards? Shen Shen Sun. Hmm? Shen Sun was another who traveled a great distance to train here. The bookie who runs the Pale Toss game? Indeed. He even earned the ring of Second Duan at Marshall Hall. I don't know where he went wrong, but he's been reduced to a lowly ruined bookie now. I had no idea. Sadly, his passion and drive left him. Excuse me. Hmm. Here to train? Have you come to spar or fight one of the monks? Which will it be? A fight? Very well. At your level, Red Tiger should be a good match. That's enough to raise your rank. Thank you. Do not get complacent. You must aim ever higher. Excuse me. Hmm. Here to train? Have you come to spar or fight one of the monks? Which will it be? Thank you. 
I have the perfect sparring partner for you. This is Red Tiger. You may start immediately. wish to keep going. I'm sure you do. Come back anytime. I'll be waiting. Excuse me. Hmm. Here to train? Have you come to spar or fight one of the monks? Which will it be? Come back anytime. I'll be waiting. Excuse me. What is it? I hear I can earn some money here. If you're chopping, I'm paying. Chopping wood? Yeah. Will you do it? Perfect. 
Perfect. Oh. Well done. I guess this should do it. No, I'm good. Well, I ain't forcing you to do anything. The job will be waiting for you. Excuse me. What is it? I'm here to shop. Hmm. What do you need? Oh, changed your mind? No. Excuse me. What is it? There's something I want. What's that? I'll be here. Thanks. Pardon me. Hey there! I'm looking for someone who's seen those thugs. Beat me, and I'll tell you. You're on. Too bad, kiddo. No. Mm, your kung fu's not good enough. Go train at Marshall Hall, and we'll start over. <laughs> Marshall Hall, huh? <laughs> <laughs> 